using the TI Inspire CAS handheld. Video 1. Things to know before you start. Part 5. Templates and Symbols. So when using your CAS calculator there are lots of different templates that you might want to use and some of these come up quite easily and, and quickly and you don't even think of them as templates and some of them you might want to access um, through the template palette. So um, pressing uh, the template palette is the button just next to the number 9, to the right of the number 9, and that will bring up every template that's available to you in the CAS calculator. So fractions, powers, roots, logs, hybrid functions, absolute value functions, degrees, minutes, seconds, matrices, derivatives, limits, integrals, etc, etc. So all of those um, templates are available to you here. Many of them are available much more um, easily just through the keypad. So for example, if I'm entering an expression involving a fraction, uh, I wouldn't go through the template palette. Just pressing Control divide brings up the fraction template and then I can enter in an expression as I intended it to be. Um, similarly, uh, using the um, arrow, so the, the hat, so if you press three hat, that's giving you, sorry, I pressed two things there at once. Um, sorry, pressing three and then um, the hat brings up the power button, um, pressing control hat brings up the nth root, pressing control square brings up the square root, um, pressing control 10 to the power of x brings up uh, log to the base n, um, you've got natural log in there, you've also got um, all sorts of other templates. There are some other shortcuts that we'll talk to about as we go to specific um, areas of the course as well, but pressing things like shift plus and shift minus bring up derivatives and integrals. There are lots of different ways that you can access um, the templates, but the main ones you'll probably use quite frequently are to press control divide um, to bring up the fraction template, but they are all available to you here in um, the template palette. The other thing you might want is various symbols and again there's a symbol palette so if you press control book um, they're all the symbols there that you might need to use, uh, all the symbols that the CAS has access to, um, but those are also accessed in various other places as well. So you might press um, control equals to get some of the substitutes for an equal sign, the inequality is not equal to given that, which we'll talk a bit about. There are also symbols down here in the pi button next to the alpha keys, next to the letter H. Um, there are some symbols there. Also some symbols to the right of the alpha keys, so next to the letter G, um, some more punctuation style symbols, so lots and lots of symbols about that you can either access through the symbol palette or um, using various um, shortcuts on the um, keypad.